Still ahead tonight on Time Warner Cable 8 News at 7. Where could you go locally to see medieval knights battling in full armor? Well, our VIP Chautauqua has the answer, and it does not involve time travel. That and more after the break. Be right back. Time now for our VIP Chautauqua with Cable 8's James Reed. And tonight in the third and final part of our profile of the Shire of Herentier, James introduces you to one of several local society for creative anachronism members who hail from outside the U.S. Meet Marcus Stendahl, a.k.a. Duke Marcus Eisenwald, a local SCA member for two years now. So what was it that originally brought him to the SCA of his native Sweden almost 20 years ago? I always liked history. I liked the, uh, the aspect of armies clashing and also the uh, skill of arms. And just fascinated with everything from the Knights Templars to the, uh, the Knight of the mid-1300s. Basically the foot soldier versus the nobility and, and the differences. My character now would be uh, Marcus, a, uh, a crusader from 1188. The other item I usually portray is a uh, Landsknecht of 1524. And I'm trying to build up my armor kit for a uh, English nobility of the 1351. So. so you're not limited to just one character? You're never limited. You can do basically whatever you want. Uh, some people are in it just a little bit. They have, you assume the name and just go along because your friends are in it. Other people uh, have the possibility to, to uh, spend every weekend and thousands of dollars and everyone plays at their, the level they feel comfortable at, so to speak. And there were a lot of SCA characters on hand for the Shire of Herontier's annual harvest raid this past weekend. Seneschal Brian Newman explains the concept of the medieval identities most SCA members choose to adopt. What we do is we try and create a persona not that actually lived during the Middle Ages, but could have lived during the Middle Ages. We don't want a bunch of Henry VIII's running around. Uh, so we try and create a persona or a character that could have lived during that time, and we'll research names that, or, and combinations of names that could have been used during that time period from whatever area and time you were interested in. Now, if you missed out on the Harvest Raid event, it is still possible to see a demonstration of Heron Tier's skills. Besides being a big part of the annual Scandinavian Festival's Viking Village, the local SCA chapter also holds occasional public exhibitions. We've done demos in the, the local mall. We've done demos in parks. Uh, we've, we've done a number of demos in schools. Oftentimes when a school does a medieval unit, the last that we come in, uh, same with Boy Scouts and, and, and churches and groups like that. Uh, so many of our members work, so we can't always be available all the time, uh, but we do demos as often as we can when people ask. All right, thanks, James. Now, for more information on the Shire of Herentier, you can find them online via the website listed there on your screen.